I'm gonna do a quick diagnosis on this transmission. It won't shift properly. It starts off in third gear and drive. You can manually shift it down to first, but you only get second. And then you can manually shift it two, three, and four, and it works fine, but you can never get first gear. So I'm checking the electrical part right now. I'm gonna to try to set this phone so I don't drop it. Somewhere where you can see everything, which is not possible. I hate not having a tripod or something. Uh, I've got the scanner here to where I can upshift and downshift whatever gear I want. I've got the plug obviously here for the transmission pulled up out so I can scan it easily. So spot A on that plug is the one, two, the one, two shift. So if I put the probe in the one, two, Uh, of course, the wire's stuck. I'm sorry, I cannot do this. I need like five hands to do this properly. Okay, so we don't have a ground right now, and that's proper because one, two should be off. Now, if I click on the downshift, see now it says on, and now we're reading a ground. We go up again, off off to third gear like it's supposed to and then up to fourth gear back on again and it's reading right and this reads right also for the two three shift and the three two shift when i command it they're all working properly and i verified obviously that every one of these wires in the plug through continuity all the way to the proper space or yeah, the proper spaces inside the, the ECM connectors, they're all exactly where they should be. Not a single wire mixed up, nothing. Also on the transmission plug, if I hit the, the pink 12 volts, I got 12 volts. If I hit the ground, I've got good ground. So the transmission is getting proper power, proper ground, all the solenoids are getting the proper signals that they're supposed to to shift, but the transmission is not shifting. So that tells me the problem is after the ECM and the harness and with the transmission itself in one way, shape or another, it's either an internal wiring problem with the transmission, maybe the harness is bad, or maybe some of the solenoids are bad, or there's something wrong with the valve body, etc. Either way, further diagnosis or replacement of transmission will need to be done.